Harry, from what you told me, this must be one of the most difficult cases you've ever had. Yes, Bob. Matching which with a clever criminal is a tough job. In this case, all the criminal leaves behind to mark his vicious trail is a knife and his victim. How do you expect to find this man when you don't even know what he looks like? There's an accomplice, a woman, a striking woman. In other words, Bob, it's a case of chaise la femme. Meaning what? Find the woman and you'll find the man. Fortunately, I know who she is. You know, trailing these criminals the way you do, without them getting wise, must take a lot of smart thinking. Oh, not so much smart thinking, Bob, as years of hard practice. That's why I wanted you to come with me on this case. Would have given you some valuable experience, helped you over the hurdles, and besides, it would have advanced you right off the bat. I understand. Did you think over all of the things I told you last night, Bob? I sure did, Uncle Harry, every word of it. And I appreciate you recommending me to the U.S. Marshal. Also, his offer to put me in office right away. It had been the beginning of a fine career. I know that. And no doubt someday I'm going to join up. But not right now, Uncle Harry. Uh, you see, I want to be free for a while, a, a chance to roam a bit and see things. I think I understand. Although I will admit I'm disappointed. I kind of figured on killing two birds with one stone. I sort of counted on you coming with me on this trip. I could use you, you know. Here she comes, right on time. Uncle Harry, good luck. You behave yourself, young man. I'll do that. Yeah. Yeah. 